My name is Francois, mainly a photographer, a reporter, do some gigs as a DJ with all my life in Antwerp. Well, Sabam seems to be skimming all the profits of people who are enjoying themselves uh, in small venues. Here in Belgium, it's virtually impossible to form music in whatever way, recorded or live bands, without Sabam mixing in and uh, skimming off the profits. They say they are defending the rights of the writers, of the musicians. The musicians here in Belgium, which, which are best selling, yep. they get the profits. And small bands, they never see their money because they're they are too small. Say what you mean, they seem like a crook. Like a band is working here in Belgium, they are a bunch of crooks. I don't think anyone gets better from a band. Maybe the, the, big, uh, the big guy. This is a... This is a free performance. Anyone who can, who will, can come in. Yep. They don't have to pay any money. People are enjoying themselves. And I think when, when everything's free, there's no basis for Sabam. Even if it's free, you're performing music, so you have to pay. Now Sabam has bought the lists with names of people who, ha who have uh, small stores. Yep. And they have to pay Sabam just, just to play the radio. Do you think the artists really understand what's going on? Well, I don't think all of them do. Some of them just go with the flow and they think, well, yeah, Saban is normal, they, they defend my rights and uh, if, I, if I perform, I will, get, uh, I will get the money or if my songs are played on, uh, they get airplay, I will get my money. I think they, they realize it, 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 it doesn't have to be that way. Yep. What, what do you think about this kind of free culture approach to music? I think this is the future because I believe there are lots of people just like me think that things have went too far. Spinning out of control, main groups getting so big, they're completely out of control. When you go to a gig from a well-known artist, you have to pay through your nose to get in. For now, the, the best places will be auctioned, so you know for sure that when, when you're on a low budget, you will never get to see any artist uh, in the front row. And I believe we can start a culture where people on a low budget can go out and enjoy themselves with virtually no money. Evening of fun doesn't have to be the same as an evening spending lots of money. The more people are on, the more you can enjoy yourself. It doesn't have to be expensive and as long as we can keep out the sharks who run with the money.